Hello fellow YouTubers, it's Julian V here, and today we're taking a look at NECA's Alien Covenant Neomorph. So first, we're going to take a look at this guy's sculpt. So first, we'll look at the alternate head. Nice scary look, white color, a little hint of pink, not too much right here in the face and ears. Um, nice dark brown wash right here in the teeth, nice black and gray wash. Looking very awesome and nasty and scary. Um, so now for the name of itself. Looking very, very cool. Looking awesome. Um, his teeth are nice and like brownish, like kind of white. And in between the like black gums looking awesome. Roof of the mouth is looking awesome. Tongue looks awesome. Um, again, the face is like with a hint of pink. The neck's a little bit of pink. The whole thing's like with a hint of pink and like a brownish low color. So like very, very hints of it. Feet, there's a lot of like brown and pink. Looking very cool. Spines right here. Looking awesome. More spines. The tail looks like a rat. Very, very cool. Love this figure. Six fingers, just like the other Xenomorph. This is my favorite from the movie. Uh, very new and very different. And very, very scary and creepy. So that's it. Oh, wait, no, not yet. We have this little guy. Also came with him, the baby Neomorph. Um, well, like, he has, like, blood. Very basic, plastic, but very cool addition. Um... Spine right here, looking very nice. All that blood. Okay, so that's it for um, sculpt. Okay, so for articulation. Oh my god, my camera. Sorry everyone, my camera fell. Um, but um, so for articulation, we have a ball joint right here in the head, looking that way. Can't look that way. No down, no up. Um, the arm can go out like that. And like that. Full 360 like a pro. Um, uh, the elbow area could go like that much. Back out that much. Little swivel right here. Um, 360 like a pro again. Hinge right there in the wrist. And a full 360 right there, like a pro. Um, you do got some movement in the abs. So you got a little crunch right there, not too much. This is how it would be straight. This is how it's crunched, not too much. Little back crunch right there. And to the sides, not that much. Not that much, like, at all. But, um... The hip movement right here in the leg, hindered by this little plate right here. But I can't go in that much. Full 360, like a pro. And um, the knee right here, go in like that much. And the ankle, a little bit of articulation, not too much. I don't want to push it. I'm thinking I might break it. But you also got some art toe articulation. So for so-called accessories, we have the extra head and the baby Neomorph. Now I forgot to put this in articulation, but he does have movement in the head, full 360 like a pro, and full 360 in the leg like a pro. But I don't want to do it all the way because it might break, but um, I know it does that. It could go like running poses, looking and that's it for technically accessories so for my overall opinion i love this guy i think you like him too um if you didn't like alien covenant that much you don't have to get him but if you're like a full collector of NECA's aliens and predators i would get him i'm a full collector i love NECA's figures and they're awesome and um he's just another alien for me another cool 
alien to battle with my colonial marines on my little set I have. So, um, thank you for watching. Remember, make sure you smack that like button, subscribe, and uh, write a nice comment. And uh, whatever you do, always collect the extra figures.